Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. I took the bait again. Palmetto State Armory. They make it easy to take the bait because they're budget priced handguns in most cases. And that's what I have in this case. Met up with Gary, a guy I have done local deals with. Awesome guy. Shout out to him. He is a TFG viewer. So what do I have in the case? Well, this is a Dagger Micro. This was introduced, SHOT Show 2022. It was released about six months ago, and there are already many aftermarket parts for it because this is the same size and many interchangeable parts with the Glock 43X, the Glock 43, the Glock 48, the, the slides, the barrels, the recoil assembly, the frames, and here is a Glock 43x all right so many of these parts are interchangeable so you look at the slide you say well that has been upgraded well that is true but if you do a search you will see that there are many companies true Pre precision the glock store 80 percent arms zafiri they they make aftermarket slides with lightning cuts in there fiber optic night sights you name it optic ready everything that glock did not do with the initial launch with the 43X. They now do, but you can do it with the Micro Dagger or this, I can put this whole slide assembly on the 43X and vice versa, you get the point. I wanna talk about this though. This is a magazine that holds 15 rounds made by Palmetto State Armory. Gary put two of them in there. These are called the Micro Slick. They cost 32 bucks. And what the difference is, is that this is the Shield Arms S15 mag. This costs 42 bucks, so 10 bucks less, or nine bucks less. And when you get this, they highly suggest that you switch out the mag catch because the magazine's all metal. And they say the, the polymer on the metal is not good. What PSA did was they made a hybrid type magazine with this area being polymer. Micro slick is what it's called. And now you don't have to change out the magazine catch. Pretty ingenious. And it works just fine. And it works with the 43X, Glock 48, you name it. So three mags were included. But the slide is an upgrade. I like it that it's optic ready. Cut the fit and SMS or RMS footprint. And I have that. And it is a direct mount. So here's an SMSC I'm going to put on there. And I do think the slide looks pretty awesome with those cuts in there. So many different variations you can go with. And also, this has a Glock barrel. Do you see that? Maybe I'll zoom in a little bit. That's a Glock barrel. So it offers a lot for the MSRP. This is not the MSRP model, but 340 bucks is what they're selling the Dagger Micro for. And this one has been upgraded. And another thing I noticed, and this is huge, the Dagger, which I own, the, the for full size, well, I don't wanna say full, compact size, 3.9 inch barrel, had a trigger that was not that great. Now, I'm not a fan of the hinge triggers, although I don't mind them. This one is lighter than the original dagger. So the original dagger, call it the, just call it dagger. This is the dagger micro. Would break right around six and three quarters, seven pounds. I am measuring this at five and a quarter. It's a huge difference and upgrade because the dagger trigger was heavier it is the same looking trigger it's just lighter and it seems to me PSA did that intentionally no aftermarket work or parts were installed on this so there you go it, they, it has a nicer trigger than the original dagger and a Glock barrel and the slide I like it. I, I think they did a fine job. I don't like the original dagger trigger as much as I like this. I want to caution you on one thing though. Here is a holster made by Vetter cut for the 43X. All right. If you switch out the slide, you'll notice, let me lock the slide back. We'll lock the slide back. And if you look at the way the slide is cut, 
you can see that this is more rounded off than this is. So when I try to insert this in this Kydex holster, it won't work. And you can see that it is hung up right there. Right there. See that? See how it's hung up right there? All right, so it won't it won't work with this slide. It has to have its own holster. Now, I could switch it out if I want. I don't see any reason to do that because I went with the dagger because it is optic ready. And a lot of people don't do that and use optics, but if you choose to do that, you can. Serrated black rear sight, and this is a fiber optic front sight that is also aftermarket because it is installed on the slide that is aftermarket but i really like the 15 round mags the micro slick mags for 33 bucks and this is 42 so nine bucks less i think it looks cooler and i really like the fact that they put that lighter trigger in there i, I don't know if that's across the board i have to believe it is but i'm not really sure because this is a sample of one but i want to put the weight on here and compare it to the 43x 18 and a quarter ounces unloaded and then the 43x is 18 and 5 eighths so almost 19 ounces so not a great difference but here are 15 rounds 24 and a half there's the carry around uh, essentially 25 even glock 43x you're looking at 25 and a quarter so not a great difference a little less than a half ounce difference with the 43x and the dagger micro so there it is i'm gonna put that optic on there take this thing to the range and you'll see that all these parts are the same interchangeable with the glock 43x the glock 48 and the glock 43 Hope you liked the video. I certainly enjoyed making it. And be on the lookout for this with a range review very soon. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.